Welcome to our tutorial about the offset faces command. Let's begin by creating a box. Let's make the base, let's say 10 by 6. Press enter. Now we need to set the height. Let's say 2 units high. Press enter to accept. Now let's create a hole. We'll make it a rectangular hole with another box. Make it 3 by 2. Enter. And solid subtract. Select the solid to subtract from, right click, solid to subtract, right click. And here is our rectangular hole. Let's apply a fillet now. Before we select an edge, I'm going to specify a radius. Right click, radius, let's say 0.5, enter to accept. Now let's select all four corners of the rectangular hole. Here's our preview. Right click and enter to accept. Right click and enter to close the tool. Let's go to the Home tab. Activate the Offset Faces command from the Extruded Faces flyout. First, we select the faces to offset. You see, I'm rotating my model so I can select all of the faces inside the rectangular box. And when I finish, right click and enter. Now let's specify the offset distance. Let's say minus 0.5 units. And our offset executes. Let's activate the offset faces command again. We select our faces to offset. Last one, right click and enter. Now we need to specify the offset distance. Let's say one unit. Enter to accept and escape to close the tool. And this concludes our tutorial about the offset faces command.